Hello, my name is Michael Dudek, uh, principal of Blackstone Millville Regional High School. Last year, a committee of parents, students, faculty, school committee members, central office and building administrators came together to talk about what skills and competencies our students, these are our students pre-K through 12, need so that they will be college, career, and community ready. The group was asked to reflect on and think about the current state in education. Where are we now? but more importantly, for us to think about where do we want to be. This question provided us with a framework to establish our North Compass. Portrait of the Graduate is a process where we envision the aspirations that we have for all of our students as they leave Blackstone Millville Regional High School. The committee focused on aspects that improve our community and help people work together to problem solve, evaluate complex situations, to form a judgment. Together, we have created a list of skills that we believe are important to everyone. A BMR graduate charges through challenges as a critical thinker in leadership, communication, collaboration, civic responsibility, and in creativity. We do not know what the workforce needs in five, 10, or 20 years, but we know that we have to prepare all of our students for whatever path they choose. We have and will continue to provide students with a strong academic foundation and continue to evolve our teaching and learning practices to meet today's learners. So where do we go from here? We have identified and prioritized our portrait of the graduate skills and competencies for our district, and we will use this shared vision to lead us to our destination. These skills and competencies will require us to shift our thinking and develop plan towards meeting our goal as a district. This framework will impact instruction, assessment, and student learning. The question that we now need to address is how do we align our portrait of graduate profile to what we do in our classrooms? At the high school, we have begun to design portfolio-worthy assessments that embed critical thinking and portrait of the graduate skills into student work. In this structure, students are required to think about their learning and self-reflect. Metacognitive strategies teach students to think about their own thinking. When students become aware of their learning process, they gain control over their learning. These high-impact strategies result in positive student outcomes. Students will reflect on their learning and overall growth in standards, skills, and competencies. Additionally, they will develop individual goals for the year. Our teachers are working hard to align the portrait of their graduate work to the assessments and instructional practices that they are introducing to their students. I am eager and excited to see that work in action. So my name is Hilary Robert and I teach English at BMR High School. So I was a member of the Portrait of a Graduate Committee that was put together last year. Um, and during that time, I thought one of the biggest pieces that was really important was being able to get together with not just fellow teachers or administrators, but we also got to speak to parents in the community and also our students. So having all of these new pillars um, and having this goal in mind of where we want our students to be by the time that they're leaving us, it really has given us more of a clear direction and a focus as teachers as to what are the things that we want to incorporate into our daily lessons um, so it's no longer their completing assignment, turning it in, um, and being done with it. They now need to look back on those assignments, reflect on them, and they're using those reflections to improve their new work. Hi, I'm Jake. I'm a senior at Blackstone Millville Regional High School. I was on the committee, uh, to the portrait of a graduate committee, to look at what it means to graduate from our high school. So a lot of the things we looked at was 21st century learning skills, such as um, project-based assessments, and really looking at not testing children based on what they know and what they can apply. So instead of taking regular midterms where we sat down for a few hours and took like multiple choice and then short answer tests, and it's a lot of cramming, and once we're done cramming, we forget the material. We had to come up with projects or guided projects from our teachers and use what we learned in class through the whole year and apply that um, in some project. So instituting some of those critical thinking skills all the way into kindergarten, we're really seeing way more critical thinking and getting some of those leadership skills that are just super important for someone that graduates from high school should have.